When the call comes in, Air Force firefighters rely on their personal protective equipment, or PPE, to be able to respond effectively and safely. The Air Force Civil Engineer Center is spearheading a program to improve the safety and operational capability of the Joint Firefighter Integrated Response Ensemble, or JFIRE. JFIRE encompasses the JS List suit and also firefighter PPE or personal protective equipment, um, which includes their bunker gear, um, pants, coat, helmet, gloves. AFKEC's equipment experts are modifying JFIRE to better enable firefighters to safely operate in chemical or biological threat situations. They first addressed the old JS List suit worn under firefighter PPE. AFKEC worked with the Air Force Research Lab, industry partners, and the firefighting community to develop a new, lightweight, one-piece garment, which offers some big improvements. The material itself is anti-static and fire rated. The chemical protective overgarment is a one-piece overgarment, which is what the firefighters in the field had asked for, which takes away the issues of overlap of material. Over all of the components, we've gained a 35% weight reduction, which is huge. The lighter weight one-piece design is less bulky and improves movement while reducing the time it takes firefighters to suit up. It's a lot lighter, a lot easier to don and doff. Um, when you add the gear to it, the thumb limp addition to the suit is so beneficial putting your gloves on. The old JS list, you had a hard time um, sliding your arm through the coat and keeping your gloves and coat together. The suit, much more maneuverable. There's also a new fire rated chemical protective hood that can be worn with both of the breathing masks that Air Force firefighters use, eliminating the need to wear two hoods. Not having to wear a Nomex hood underneath of it as well reduces weight and um, reduces overall fatigue from the firefighters. J Fire modifications also include a new, lighter helmet rated for both aircraft rescue firefighting and structural firefighting, as well as new gloves and protective boots. Firefighters who have had a chance to test the JFIRE modifications like the new features. The thumb loops, the pockets, um, the uniform being able to be worn as a duty of a uniform through the day. You know, before we didn't have the pocket features of the uniforms that we have on our normal ABUs, but with this uniform it's just like wearing a one-piece ABU suit. It's just the one zip and in a matter of seconds you could be on your way to uh, any emergency that you need to fight. The new JFIRE begins operational testing at Eglin Air Force Base later this year.